Let's go back to Tomato Bobo. Well, we're here with the Springbok coach and... Uh... Guys, we, we've got Jerome here, the, the audio assistant, who went viral last week. Jerome, please give us the full story of what happened. Well, quickly. Hey! <laughs> we are back. It's a beautiful day. We are at the DHL Stadium. It's the rematch of the biggest rivalry in rugby. I've got someone with me. He's excited. Are you ready for the tasting? I am ready. Welcome to the fan. Frezzy! This is gonna be fun. Everything is gonna happen in that area. Let's go! Woo you guys are very early. What's the reason for being so early at the game? The little girl over there, after our previous World Cup win, she has become an avid Springbok supporter. Ooh. And it's her first game, so we're trying to make it the best day ever. Guys, I can't look at him because he doesn't have the green on that we love. Why is he wearing this black before, before I get to him? You have to ask him. You know, from a young age, I've been exposed to All Blacks, playing good rugby, so it's in my blood. Who's your favourite player starting today for the All Blacks? Damien McKenzie. Damien McKenzie, and what will the score prediction be for the big game? 27-24 for, for the All Blacks. 27-24 for the Bokker from the All Blacks supporter. It's going to be a fun day out there. Let's go, Bokker! Guys, are we ready for the day? Yeah, very ready. Who's your favourite player? Cesar Fan Bon Gomez Zulu. Woo! What are we thinking about today? Are uh, we going to win. Why did you guys decide to come to the game? Because I love my country and I want to see them win. And do you think we're going to be good enough today to beat the All Blacks? Yes, 100%. Give me favourite player. Cheslin Colby. Cheslin Colby, your favourite player? Obviously, I have to say Auction Chair, you know? Auction Chair, that's one for the cake eaters. I love it, absolutely. Boca! Can't wait to see a Springbok victory by 10 points. Do you agree with me? Disagree. Disagree? Um, cut it out, cut it out, cut it out. Can we get a green shirt on you? No, 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 definitely green. not. It will remain black. Okay, I've tried my best. Someone told me that all the All Blacks that stay in South Africa should get load shedding. I'm not going to say I agree, but it's not a terrible idea. We found some people that are all the way from Booster. It's an hour and a half drive. What makes this test so special that you had to come all the way to watch it? Uh, this is a once in a lifetime opportunity, I think. Uh, it's, it's been quite a while since they were in Cape Town, so uh, I think we're going to enjoy it, yeah. Who's all with you today? Uh, this is my older brother, this is my father and my wife of one year. Lovely, lovely. I love that we put in the wife factor there. Uh, yeah. Who do you think is going to play a crucial part in today's game? Billy is going to play a good part from behind. I think he's going to bring a, a calmness over the back line on defence especially. And Polly is also always a cool head, so it's going to be necessary in a final test like this. What about Springbok Rugby are you so proud of currently? This is, this is, this is Springbok Rugby, it's bringing people together, it's nice to see. Let's go, come on! One thing when you get to Springbok test matches that you cannot go without is the Biltong. How does this operation work? If the Springboks win, then the prices go half price, but anyhow, I'm just making it out. We know All Blacks have a lot of support here, I'm an all South African, and my friend, we all support Boca. Support the Boca and support the Baltong. Come Thank on. you, guys. <laughs> now, that is what I love about South Africans. We wait on our body as well, OK? Beautiful. Excellent. The last time the box won in Cape Town. Uh, no, no, I'm saying I put this on 2005. And you know what? Those years, it wasn't fashionable to have a spring walk tattoo on your body. Okay. People would ask me, like, why would you do that? It looks beautiful. Thank I you, love it. Brother. I'm supporting you guys. Thank you so much. Quite, quite. Let's go. Guys, I found a Springbok. He's probably the most electrifying player that I've ever played with. What a Kalant. Um, you're very early. Are you excited for this game, Boyki? Yeah, I'm actually early because I want to watch a woman play. Nice. That, that's the first thing. But very excited by the great day in Cape Town. How do you think is going to be the most important part for the box to win? And how do you think the All Blacks can beat the Springbok team? Uh, Polly bringing the stability and Valley obviously doing the playmaking. I think with Kanan in will be a, a better aerial threat. I think for the All Blacks, it's a, it's a very big gamble with Will Jordan at 15. They're reverting back right to how they played at the Crusaders, which is a very suffocating uh, sort of game plan. But I still think the Springboks will pull it through, just with the edge that Tony Brown brings to the player. 
Uh, uh, guys, that is rugby intelligence. You can't buy it. Any pick and buy or any shop, okay? Core prediction? 24-17 for the Springboks. And also, who's going to be the player that's going to stand out today? Andre Pollard and Diamond Delendi. I'm going to go with the standout player, Grant Williams. And I think the box are going to be too strong for this All Black team. We are here at the beer tent. And I want to find out if they are prepared to host Madame quickly. Are you guys ready for what is about to come your way? We are most excited to be here helping the people and to experience it as well. What is the favorite that everybody wants? Definitely Castle Lager, I have to say, and the Clippies and Cola. How many liters of beers do you guys think will be sold today? The best answer for that would be an infinite amount. I've made my way into the chip and dip station. Ladies, who do you shout for? Who do you, who do you guys love? Springboks or Blacks? Springbok. Got some Springbok fans here. Okay, come on, Boka. Woo! Nice chippy. Ooh, it's hot. Guys, it's, we just don't have the Springboks playing the All Blacks today. We're also very blessed to have the Springbok women's up against Barbarians. We can see them in the background. they got a new coach, Space the Brain. They are so lucky to have him, and this is going to be an excellent game. And I'm here to support them. Let's go, Boka! Woohoo! I want to know, firstly, you dress to impress. Who are you today? I'm Faf the Clerk today. Got my speedo. I'm neat. Okay, we definitely have the Spuff Speedos on. I don't get cold, I get warm, so... Secondly, if you were Rashi, what would your message be for the team before the game? Do it for your country. Do it for your country. If he says so, I'm not going to disagree with him. Let's go. Come on. Young man, are you excited for today? Yes. Who is your favourite player? Who do you love watching? Faf. Faffy the Clare, Faffy, another Faffy fan. And if you could say, who would score the first try in today's game? See ya. See you for the first try. Okay, guys, three to spring box. Ooh, exciting. Let's go. I brought my friend with today to the slaughterhouse for the All Blacks. So I'm going to pack it a good pack it What's your even? Yeah, it's going to be a good game. I think uh, last week we had a bit of a mishap, uh, especially at the end of the game. But overall, I think today will be amazing because of the atmosphere and because the All Blacks have such a huge uh, following, especially in Cape Town. So I think it's going to be a good game. It's going to be a good game, but we'll still, we, we'll still be the winners. Yeah, we'll, Obviously. we'll about that. No, no, we'll no, 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 it's a given. Okay, it's a given. okay. That's why we're in black, because we're going to the funeral. Well done, yeah. Okay, well, yeah, yeah. I'll, leave the, I'll leave the comments for after the game. Yeah, you won't have comments at all. <laughs> you won't have comments. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Hi. Good Boca! Good Boca! Win the championship for us! Woo! Proudly South African! Proudly South African. It's my birthday today. <laughs> Please win for me. For me. Nobody else. found another young Springbok fan over here, all the way from Pretoria to support his beloved Springboks. And who are you, who are you here to watch? I want to watch Kaubi. You want to see some feet? You want to see some action? Yeah. Give me quickly a score prediction. 28-14. 28-14. And can I get a Boko on three? One, two, three. Boko! I can't hear you. One, two, three. Boko! Here we go, Boko! How are we feeling before the game? Excited or nervous? Nervous. Are you foreseeing an All Black win? No. No! I love this! He's very honest. Favorite player in the All Black team? Damien McKenzie. D-Mac, the favorite player. And then score prediction, lastly. A one-point difference, a, maybe. Three. A one-point difference. Okay, that's from All Black fan. Quickly, I want to know, what do you think will happen out there today? We are definitely going to win. We're just coming to see the result. That's basically it. We're going to pull some last-minute stunts. Favorite Springbok player ever? Oh, that's easy. Just a creel. Jesse Creel! <laughs> Jesse Creel! I could see in her face! Let's go, Boca! Woo! How are we looking? How are we feeling? Are we excited we for the game? so excited! Yeah, Vis Bang is so. Vis Bang, we are not bang for them. Can we get a favorite player from you guys? Uh, Sia, no doubt. Sia, no doubt. Uh, Peter Steph. Peter Steph, the twin. And Granty Boy Williams. Ooh, I'm with you. Grant is also my favorite player. What would you say to the team right now in the change room? And Murala. There we go. All I see is people pouring in 
seven years since the last game. In the last game, I was actually part of the lineup, so this is magnificent. Oh, the people are going to make this an electrifying test match, and I'm going to make sure that I get everything, okay? Come follow and see more. They are busy capturing everything around the stadium. Look at how focused he is for this job. I love this guy. He's making sure that you guys out there get the best view. Uh, watch me at work. Fantastic. Who are you most looking forward to see today? Sia. Sia? JC. Grill. So much faith in Sia. Let's go, box. Let's get there. Are you going to watch the whole warm-up? Are you going to sing along with the team? Are you going to wait for them after the game? Yeah, 100%. Everything. Everything. Okay. Going for all. We're going to smash the All Blacks. We're going to get it. Yes, 2023 World Champions. Let's get it. Do you guys want to, first of all, become future Springboks? Yes. Do you guys play rugby? What positions? Flank, lock, and eight. I play wing and center. I play fly off. Now you fly off. I've got a wing and a center. Who are you here to see? Sia Khaleesi. Andre Pollard. Justin Colby. Oh, that's exciting names. They're going to be all on the field, boys. Welcome. If this might be the most important people today, what is your day like at a test match? It's just to be on the outlook for anyone that uh, would want to disturb the game. We've got a job to do, and we have to do it to the best of our ability. I love it. And I've got to ask you a rugby question. I know you're at work, but who are you supporting today? The Boko or the All Blacks? I'm a Boko Boko. I'm a Boko Boko, it is. Let's go, Boko! Blitzbok captain, bronze medalist, and today's flag bearer, Sylvan David Spanier. How are we feeling? What is it like being here at the DHL Stadium today? Uh, happy to be here and excited for the game. Boys are playing good rugby, uh, uh, surfing the ball around a bit, and yeah, it's great to see and it's lovely to watch. How does it feel to have a bronze medal around your neck, going to the Olympics, capturing the Blitzbok team? How did that feel and what is it like being an Olympian? Yeah, amazing. Never thought I would be there, um, let alone the, the being captain and get the bronze medal. So yeah, it's amazing. It's it's great to do things for your country uh, and just uh, giving out to the, to the people again. I've got nothing else to say. I'm just excited to stand next to an Olympian and Blitzbok captain. Woo! Let's go, Boca! Yeah, Guys, I have found a voice that I grew up watching rugby. The guy who made me fall in love with every Curry Cup game and any Curry Cup game. Uncle Hugh Bladen, firstly, how are you doing? Uh, lovely to see you. I remember commentating your... You came on as a youngster and I was on the field watching you and I thought that boy can draw this game. Guys, that is you, Bladen. I am in absolute awe currently that I had the privilege to speak to such a legend. Ladies and gentlemen, I am in a secret, sacred area. This in the background is what is up for grabs today. We have the Freedom Cup over there. Hasn't been within our offices since 2009, then they we got the rugby championship. And I truly believe that the Boca will be lifting that Freedom Cup and we will end the drought. Oh, this is special. This is special. Come on. As we can see here behind me, the spring box are warming up. I must say, this is truly a magnificent stadium. The last time the Springboks and the All Blacks met in Cape Town was still at Newland. It's a new field, new stadium. And I believe there will be new memories for Springbok Rugby. The boys are truly excited. The place is filling up. The Boca will put on a show. And we are truly in for a spectacle. These boys know what to do. And I can't wait to see what they get up to. Let's go, Boca. Come on! They've won the Freedom Cup. We've gone back to back against the All Blacks in South Africa. This has truly been phenomenal to be part of this today. Guys, I've cleared the rock. They're going to lift the trophy now. And we should all enjoy this week. Let's go, Buffalo!